Hello everyone and welcome back to reading comments last week I told you guys to leave comments on that video so that I could read them this week And I think there was like 900 comments, so thank you so much. I read them all. They're all really awesome But obviously I could only pick so many for this video So I picked them and now we're gonna read them. Hey Matt. I love your videos. It entertains me every time I feel kind of gloomy You're the best. I wanted to ask you how you know Brandon Thank you so much, first of all, and second of all, I met Brandon back in, I think, September 2013. Me and Brandon were both doing videos on Surgeon Simulator, and uh, I found out how to get the alien surgery, and I posted a video on it, and he credited me in his video, and then I tweeted to him, I was like, hey bro, thanks for the credit in the video, and then uh, and then he followed me on Twitter, and then we started talking on Twitter, and then uh, eventually we just became friends, and now we occasionally record together. Matt, rate my channel, please. Zero out of ten. I hope you don't quit YouTube. That would suck. Yes, it absolutely would suck, but lucky you, I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. I'm now a full-time YouTuber, and uh, unless something big happens, that's staying that way. Damn, those eyebrows are huge. Yep, they are, and you know what they say about people with huge eyebrows? Nothing, they, they really don't say anything about us. Hi, I've been watching from about 10,000 subs, and I love your videos. My question is, could you play with subscribers sometime? I haven't got a computer, so I can't. Just think about other people who love you. Yes, I will, and I have, and I do. Um, basically, the best way, if you want to play with me, is to join the Steam group, and then when I'm live streaming, sometimes I do multiplayer games. Like uh, last live stream, we played some Grand Theft Auto V on PC, and we also played some Fistful of Frags, and I played a little bit of Minecraft. It was a horrible experience. There was just, it was just chaos. Okay, I don't understand the game anymore. It used to be you go and you mine and you craft, and now it's not. Now you do a whole lot of crazy shit. Am I allowed to ship myself to you and just give you a huge hug because you're the best smiley face? No, please do not ship yourself to me and if you do, at least put holes in the box because I am sick and tired of having dead women showing up at my door. If you were in a horror movie, do you think you would be the survivor, the killer, or someone who dies, aka which stereotype do you think you would be? Honestly, if I was in a movie, I would probably be that guy who doesn't get killed by the killer. But, I won't be the guy surviving. You know how there's always this one guy in a movie who does something so stupid that they die on their own? Like, you know, you're running away from something and you hit a tree and you get stabbed, something like that. That's me. That's what I'm gonna do, because I am an idiot. The line under is true. The line above is false? <laughs> do you get enough sleep? Your eyes have circles or bags or dark circles. Yes, they do have circles or bags or dark circles. It is not my fault, okay? I could use makeup to cover it up if I wanted, but uh, my I think my mom has it and my sister and my brother have it. I've addressed it before, okay? I went through the comments for this video and there were like four different comments pointing out that I have shitty eyes. I know, guys. Like, look at this. Look, look. Do you see this here? You, can you see that? Dark circles. It's 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 not as easy to see when I have these lights shining. Okay, it's even worse in real life, especially if you got a bit of a shadow cast. But there's not a whole lot I can do about it. Okay, <laughs> that's just how it is. Unless I wear makeup, I'm gonna have dark circles under my eyes. I really hope you guys can just get past it and you know just watch the videos anyway. Maybe that's why I don't do face cam because you guys make fun of me. Why does my cat always watch me sleep? If your cat is watching you sleep, that is a sign that it's planning to kill you. Get out of the house immediately. Take a train, take a bus, take a taxi, take a plane. I don't care. Just please get out of the country because your cat will- wait a minute. This comment is four days old. Rest in peace, Stella. Rest in peace. Here, Matt, I drew your beautiful mug. Thank you so much. I'm gonna show you guys this right here. This is the picture that Plato drew for me, and uh, I really appreciate fan art. If you guys have any fan art you would like to send me, please do that. You can tweet it to me on Twitter with the hashtag Matt Shea, or just like, just tag me, you know, with the Twitter, at Matt Shea. Doesn't really matter, just tag it some way so that I can see it, and uh, I will really appreciate it. Any art I get is good art to me, okay? Doesn't matter how bad it is, I still really, really appreciate it. So, if you got art, this guy, send it here. Yo Matt, being an Aussie myself, what are your thoughts on Australia? P.S. Love your videos. Keep it up, mate. Thank you so much, and uh, Australia is absolutely terrifying. I want to go there someday, but I also want to survive, so I'm not really sure about that one. Like, they have spiders the size of your face, and they have, I don't know, lizards the size of your leg, and kangaroos, man. Kangaroos aren't cool either. They, they kick people. You are attractive as fuck. What's your secret? Maybe I was born with it, 
And maybe I stole someone's skin and sewed it to my face. You just bit down on an entire bloody orange with the skin on because someone asked you how to eat one? Huh, fair enough. On a completely unrelated note, how do you eat a lemon? Step one, get a lemon. Step two, you thought I was gonna say eat the lemon, right? No, no, when you, when you eat a lemon, you need to peel it first, okay guys? This is a different strategy altogether, okay? You can't stick to one thing all the time. So we're just gonna uh, try and peel this bastard here. It's not easy to peel a lemon, okay? Cause, uh, cause you know, they're pretty, pretty tough, pretty tough fruits here. So we're just gonna, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll get there. Okay, so once you're done peeling the lemon, you're gonna have this and then the next step, just eat it. Mmm. Mmm. That is, that is some good lemon, man. Mmm. I'm gonna do it. And that is how you eat a lemon. If you were a girl slash woman, what would you do first? Put on my makeup. Please can you say house, mouse, and louse. It's just so funny, lol. House, mouse, louse. I'm from Newfoundland, guys, for those of you who don't know. That's a place in Canada. And even the other Canadians make fun of us for our accents, okay? Something else that a lot of people uh, like to hear me say is like car and far and bar. Because, I don't know, I guess... I guess for everyone else, it's car or far or whatever. It's it's weird. It's, it's weird to try and say things like someone else. Um, but yeah, we say car and far and bar and 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 I can't think of any other words. Okay, I'm not very good with words. You are the greatest boss in the world. Sorry, wrong YouTuber. <laughs> Do you beat your meat before you eat it? What the hell is wrong with you, man? You don't beat kids. What type of human organs are in that box? Spooky. You're talking about that box right there. A lot of people like to mention that box right there because they don't know what's in it. Um, and uh, this is from a while ago. It's from some of my old videos. Surgeon Simulator, the people behind Surgeon Simulator, Bossa Studios, they sent me a care package. They also sent a care package to Tobuscus and... Uh, I think NerdCube and some other people like that. Some some big Surgeon Simulator players. So I got one as well because they love me, obviously. And uh, I'll show you what's in it. So this is actually just a lunchbox, okay? It's, there's no actual human organs in there. And they uh, they stuffed it with some Surgeon Simulator stuff. I'm not sure how much is still in here, but uh, I'll show you anyway. So we've got this thing. This is a uh, certificate from Matt Shea. Advises that I've satisfied all requirements, successfully passed the examination, uh, and is properly qualified to practice a specialty of surgery. So I'm a verified surgeon according to them. That's pretty cool. Also got a notepad in here. We got the uh, stethoscope and uh, some, like postcards. And we got surgeon simulator pens right here and buttons and all kinds of good stuff. So this is my little like, I don't know, souvenir basket for surgeon simulator. Hey Matt, if I send you stuff, will you open it on vid? Yes, I absolutely will. In fact, I have a couple letters today that I'm going to show you guys before I end this video. The first one is from nobody. I don't know who it's from, but it is freaking colorful. It's got my address right here. This is the address if you want to send me anything, but it will also be uh, down below in the description. And it's in my about page on the YouTube channel. So if you want to check that out and you want to send me anything, that's where you got to go. So let's go ahead and open this baby up and see what's inside. There's a, there's a, there's a few things in here, okay? It's not just a small letter. There's uh there's it's pretty thick, okay? So I'm, I'm pretty pretty excited about that. Woo! Oh, it's even more colorful in here. Wow. Okay. Matt Shea, 197,329 subs. So this was from a few weeks ago. It says Wizward official. Official Wizward. Am I an official Wizward? Is this like my certificate? I don't know. Sims 4, subscribe, subscribed. My own grandpa. So just wrote a bunch of stuff on here. Dear Matt, thank you for making me laugh every day. Even on my worst days when I didn't feel like it, when I see you have uploaded, I really get happy slash excited. I'm going through a really tough time with depression, and you're helping me stay positive. Thank you. P.S. I will send you more stuff. I just don't have enough money yet. Sorry, 
I love you and keep doing YouTube, please. Thank you so much for the letter, Jess. And I just want to say thank you to all you guys out there who, you know, support me. And I really appreciate that I can make such a difference to you guys. So if there's anyone out there who's going through depression or is going through a tough time, just know that I'm here, okay? And you can watch me and you can think of me as a friend because you guys are all my friends. I really appreciate each and every one of you. So if you have anything you want to say, you can go ahead and leave it in the comments and I will always try my best to reply to it, especially if I think it needs a reply. So yeah, anybody out there who's going through a tough time, I really hope that you get through it as best you can and uh, I wish you the best. Okay, so now we're going to go on and read the second letter. It is from a surprise once again, a card from It's a Surprise. I didn't know they even like stamped that on here, but uh, this is Priority Mail from G Guernsey. I don't know where Guernsey is, but anyway, it's addressed to me, obviously. <laughs> Who else would it be addressed to? And we're going to open it see what's inside. It feels really fancy. I'm not going to lie, guys. Okay, guys. So it is a picture of me wearing a wizard hat with glasses on it. And it says deal with it underneath. And in it, it says to Matt Shea. Thank you. Wish I could afford to send something better. Don't don't worry about it. It does not matter what you send me. I just appreciate you sending me anything at all, so thank you. I do not have any skill other than programming, and I'm short on money, so I decided to send a postcard with no design. <laughs> thank you, Matt, for keeping me and almost 200,000 people happy every day. You cheer me up even when I'm depressed. Thanks, Matan. Matan, you have been around a long time, and I really appreciate you, buddy. You are awesome. Thank you so much for the letter. Thank you everyone who sent me a letter so far. And as I said before, if you want to send me anything, you can absolutely do that. And I will be really happy and I will open it on camera. And, you know, you kind of get a shout out, I guess, in a way. So, uh, you know, if you want to send me anything, just feel free to do it. I'm not pressuring you into doing it. I know it's expensive, especially if you're like international or something like that. But, uh, yeah, I appreciate you guys for sending me stuff like that. It makes me feel really special. And I do feel really special considering there are over 200,000 of you who, you know, support me every day. And uh, I just want to say thank you once again for the 15th time this video. I'm going to end this video here, guys. So thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.